Want to tell you more about an event coming up in just a matter of weeks uh, with the uh, Springfield Lucky Horseshoes as they kick off their season. But it's also a way to bring the community together and to raise funds and awareness about cancer and especially uh, when youth get cancer. Uh, it's June for June, helping out uh, a very special cause. And part of that's going to be a bags tournament, but also a silent auction. And joining us to talk more about this is Taylor Stevens with Synergy Home Care. Taylor, you have been integral in putting this together, uh, especially the silent auction, so that we can have more funds being raised. Uh, tell us where you're at right now, and let's make that appeal for businesses. Sure. So first and foremost, I want to talk about what the event is. It's called Go June for June. This is going to be a cornhole tournament um, or benefit per se that's going to benefit Alex's Lemonade Stand, um, which is a foundation that raises funds um, for childhood cancer. So we are going to be doing a silent auction, 50-50, a cornhole benefit, um, all these good things, all raising money for childhood cancer. And this is obviously something that uh, it's not an easy issue to talk about, uh, but you got to think about the the children who are impacted by this and just how much uh, support they need from the community. Uh, and this is one way to do that. So again, put it on your calendar, June 11th. It's going to be 5:30 gates open there at Springfield Lucky Horseshoes at Robin Roberts Stadium. Uh, the bags tournament's going to start at 6:30. Uh, there's also going to be a 50/50 raffle. Uh, but let's talk a little bit about the um, the the silent auction. Because this is a this is a way to find unique items and different services that uh, businesses around the area are offering, and you can make bids on that. Uh, tell us where you're at right now, and uh, let's let's get that appeal out there to businesses to to reach out to you and make it happen. Yeah, so right now I don't have as many donations as I would like to see. Um, like you said, this is a fun way to raise some money and for people to maybe put stuff out for their business. You know, you can have a little boutique or um, so you have a hair salon or anything like that. Putting together these baskets is a good way to raise some money. Um, right now I have about six, but I would like to see a lot more. Um, just to name a few, I have two Cubs tickets that are going. I have an antique baseball basket. I have a gift certificate for peace, love, and sweat. Um, I have a bag set that's coming, um, but I'd like to see a lot more that we're able to put out because I would love to raise a lot more money for this. Taylor, how can people get a hold of you uh, if they have a business, if they have a service, uh, they're hearing this right now? Uh, what's the best way for them to contact you in order to uh, take part in this and to get some of their uh, their items in front of people for a silent auction and to help raise some funds for Go June for June? Um, you can call us at our 24-hour line at Synergy Home Care. It is 217-303-8555. Again, that's a 24-hour line, so I understand that the, the days are busy. Um, our office hours are Monday through Friday, 9 to 5, but after that, it does roll over to our on-call team. Um, they're aware of this going on, um, so if you let them know that this is what you're looking for. They can get in touch with me and I can call you back, email you, text you, whatever. Um, and we can figure out a way for pickup. You've been out there, um, uh, hitting the pavement, uh, talking to businesses, putting this together, uh, and and it's been weeks and weeks and weeks in the making. We've got just a handful of weeks left here. Uh, talk about uh, how how fun this is going to be and how important of a, a community event this is to uh, to get people out. Again, it's June 11th. Doors open at 5:30 at Robin Roberts Stadium. There's going to be baseball there. Uh, there's going to be a bags tournament, a 50/50 raffle. Uh, so you're going to have all the action of baseball, but also all the food that goes along with it as well uh plus the uh the just the 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 great things that are happening there's even going to be a celebrity there right yeah, so Corbin Bernstein is going to be there. He's going to make a special appearance, which I think is fabulous. Um, he's going to take part in this as well. Um, and like you were saying earlier, childhood cancer is not an easy topic, but it is real. Um, almost 700 children are diagnosed every single day, and 4% of funds are for childhood cancer. So I'm asking everybody for your help in helping me and helping Synergy and, and raising money to make that 4% so much more. Yeah, and and you got to think about the families that are impacted by this. Uh, that's not a, a diagnosis that they necessarily want to hear. Uh, it's something that uh, it takes time, money, resources, uh, and e emotions to to have to work through. 
Uh, it's one thing for adults to go through this. It's another thing for for children uh, to be diagnosed. So uh, do what you can to help out. Of course, it's uh, June for June, uh, helping out uh, to fund Alex's lemonade stand at uh, Robin Roberts Stadium uh, as part of uh, an ongoing effort to uh, to raise awareness and funds for childhood cancer. Joining us right now is Taylor Stevens. She's with Synergy. Uh, and uh, let's take some time here now to talk about the stuff Synergy does, uh, and then we'll kind of recap as to what we're looking for when it comes to this uh, this baseball event uh, and how you're organizing for this. So uh, the, the great thing Synergy does, I'm always floored to, to hear about uh, all the things you guys do uh, and the, the support that you provide. Sure. So Synergy Home Care um, helps people stay independent in their home, um, wherever that may be, by providing non-medical services. Um, so that could be starting with your basic companionship to personal care, to ho- light housekeeping, transportation, anything like that. And it's not just seniors. This is for all ages. Um, we are here for a solution. We're not here for a sale. Um, we find those caregivers that are doing it for a passion and not a paycheck because there is a difference. Um and that's some of the things that Synergy does, and I fully believe that um, we're one of the great assets here in the Springfield area. Well, and talk about, I mean, you, we've, we've had the, the conversation before about your passions uh, and how you got involved with this. Uh, and, and, you know, you are just one of a group at Synergy. Uh, talk about uh, uh, the, the passions that you see with your, your coworkers and how you got involved in all of this. Sure. So it's kind of funny because whenever I was younger, um, I mean, shoot, all the way growing up, but around 9, 10, I would ride my bike around town in Divernon where I grew up, which is a small town. And I would always go to elderly homes and I'd knock on the door and I'm like, hi, (laughs) I'm here. Um, Do you need any help with housekeeping? Do you need any help with anything at all? Um, And that's what I enjoyed to do. I loved being there, helping, talking, um, playing board games, whatever it may be. And then um, at one of the jobs that I had, somebody was like, hey, Synergy Home Care is coming here to Springfield and I think you'd be a really good fit. And I was like, okay, well, I'll have a conversation. And then once I started talking to them, it was like, oh my gosh, that that's what I love to do. So it was really a no-brainer. Um, it was like everything was coming full circle to where I could do what I love to do, but I was going to get paid to do it. So I didn't have to wear a different hat. I don't have to have an on and an off um, this is who I am and I get to do it all the time. Well, and I think also it shows uh, with your uh, jumping in and helping organize for this event, uh, go June for June to help out Alex's lemonade stand uh, just kind of highlights that passion that you have. Uh, So again, we're talking with Taylor Stevens. She's with Synergy Home Care uh, and also helping organize the uh, June for June event out at Robin Roberts Stadium. It's going on June 11th. Put it on your calendar. Uh, It's going to be here before you know it. A big event with the Springfield Lucky Horseshoes uh, uh, out at Robin Roberts Stadium. Again, uh, Taylor, give us the specifics on the uh, the fundraising component of this with the bags tournaments and the silent auction and more. So again, I think this is going to be an incredible evening. Um, gates open at 5.30. The baseball game and the bags benefit starts at 6.30. There is going to be 50-50. There's concession stands. There's um, the bags tournament, baseball game, all these really great things. A um, Hollywood actor is going to be oh, there. Yeah. I mean, come on. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be awesome. And it, like I said, it starts in the evening, so it won't be as hot. This is family friendly. Um, also, I partnered with Capital City Cornhole, who is going to be hosting the Bags Benefit, and then Capital City, um, who now owns the Lucky Horseshoes. Both incredible, you know, committees going into this. I think it's just going to be a really great night. Um, and, I, and, and, and let's, again, if a business out there wants to take part in this and to get their good or service uh, as part of the silent auction, uh, how can they get a hold of you? Yeah, again, you can call me at 217-303-8555. Or if you have Facebook, um, go to our Facebook page, Synergy Home Care of Central Illinois. On there, you'll find the Go June for June event. Um, You can see on there the specifics. If you can't make it but you would like to donate, there's a link on there directly to Alex's Lemonade Stand. You can donate money straight to the foundation, and you can still see it pop up on there. Taylor Stevens with Synergy Home Care and helping organize June for June to benefit Alex's Lemonade Stand, a organization that's uh, helping to uh, raise awareness and uh, get resources where they needed uh, for childhood cancer. Uh, Taylor, thank you so much for taking time. Uh, it's always good to hear about uh, all the things you're you're working on, this just being one of those. Uh, so we'll definitely talk again soon, all right? Awesome. Thank you so much. It is Springfield's Morning News. I'm Greg Bishop on 92.7 WMA.